Hey YouTubers, Ali from Potent Burnables here. So for this build, we're going to be making Griff's automatically extending bat from Back to the Future. What's wrong, McFly? Chicken? <laughs> what did you call me, Griff? Chicken! McFly! Nobody calls me... Chicken. So I'm going to describe how part of this works, but I want to see if you guys can figure out how the rest of it works. So these are the three sections that are 3D printed and collapse together and allow the bath to become a very small size. Now, in some of them, in some of these pieces, there are dovetail grooves that are printed in. And on the meaning pieces, there are dovetail tabs that slide in these grooves. And that's what allows the cylinders to slide smoothly and not bind up. And then on the ends of the larger two sections, there are these rings that get screwed in that constrain the motion of the cylinder that's contained within them and prevents them from falling out. Alright, so that's how the telescoping section of the bat works. But how do you think the rest of it works? Remember, there are no visible cords, wires, or tubing, so keep that in mind. So leave me some comments down below and tell me how you think the rest of the bat works. In the next video, I'll reveal more of those details. Hey, Mr. Mom. Nice diaper bag. What, what, what did you say to me? I said ni nice diaper bag. Yeah, yeah. That's it for this video. Be sure to hit that subscribe button if you want to find out how the bat works and if you want to see me test how strong it is because that's coming in the next video.